Good morning, this is Gabriel Jackson, and welcome to BJC Halacha Day, number 1476, a halacha that keeps the Yetzirah away. I'm so proud of all those who are still listening. I know it's not easy. It's not easy for me, but you're listening, you're learning, hopefully you're doing review, repetitions the mother of skill, and hopefully some stuff's getting in there. All right, some activities prohibited on Shabbos, once again dedicated to the safety of the Jewish people in Eretz Yisrael. May we destroy our enemies. The next malacha that the Kitzar Shechon deals with is borer, sorting. We did discuss this briefly in the previous halacha. When food is mixed with waste, they may be separated only under three conditions. Number one, it is permitted only to select the food from among the waste, but not to remove the waste from among the food. Number two, even when selecting the food, it is forbidden to select it by means of a utensil. Now a fork is really considered a hand, not a utensil, but we're talking about a professional utensil. Rather, one may select it only by hand. And number three, and even when selecting the food by hand, one may select only that which he needs to eat immediately but not something that he desires for later use. And we'll talk about what that means. There's also leniencies if you're just preparing for a meal and people are coming soon to eat. Kitzer adds that the malacha applies even to mixtures that do not contain actual waste. And even regarding a situation where different foods are mixed together and no waste is present, when people wish to sort what they will eat now and what they will leave over for later, they must be careful to, to select and use that food item which they wish to eat now and not to select and set aside that food item which they wish to leave over for later. For in this situation, that which they wish to eat now is considered the food and that which they wish to leave over is considered the waste. If, per, if there's a mixture of nuts and raisins and you do not like raisins, you have to pick the nuts from the raisins. You can't take out the raisins because the raisins would be the waste for that particular person. Another application of this malacha, even to peel garlic or onions with, with the intent to leave them over for later use, is prohibited under the malacha of borer, sorting. It is permitted only to peel that which is needed for immediate consumption. The kitzer qualifies even this limited permit. In regard to garlic, the proceeding applies to the inner skin that surrounds each individual clove. But as for the outer skin of the garlic, that surrounds all of the segments, the clothes, we prohibit its removal even for the sake of immediate consumption, for this constitutes extracting, which is a tolda of dash, threshing. Okay, there's a lot more to be discussed here in the commentaries, but we'll leave it there. Thanks for listening to Sponsor Future Lacha 36100 for the gold. See you tomorrow.